cars were pushed by floodwaters down a rushing creek and into a bridge. We showed it to you all day yesterday, happening along Highway 31 Wednesday afternoon. Yeah, today is the reality of what happened is now people are starting to deal with that sinking in, many of them questioning whether all of this could have been prevented. CBS 42 News reporter Jamie Oshoff is covering that for us. She's live along Patton Creek, which the mayor of Vestavia has said was the source of that flooding. Jamie? That's right, Jim and Sherry. You mentioned those cars floating down this very creek, very large pieces, making up quite a bit of debris that was created by yesterday's downpour, basically floating down this creek, gumming up the works right here, forcing water to spill over the banks, creating that huge mess we saw yesterday. It almost looked like a lake out there um, in the parking lot. It just happened so fast. People living at the Vestavia Park apartments describe the likes of something they've never seen before. Well, you don't think about the force of water until you really see it. And it was powerful. After a torrential downpour, water swelled over the banks of Patton Creek. Janet Poole knows exactly why it happened. It's just clogged up. You can walk back there and look and you see all the down trees and everything that's in there. So where for the water to go but out. The mayor of Vestavia Hills agrees. This is a ongoing problem. This is a floodplain area. Uh, it's not the first time that we've had water overflow Patton Creek. And it probably won't be the last, but we can certainly do what we can to mitigate what you see here. The Alabama Department of Transportation sent crews to clean out the creek Thursday, but Mayor Ashley Curry says the stopped up waterway isn't the only thing to blame for Wednesday's flood. The events of yesterday are pretty unique. I mean, I've heard estimates of up to five inches of rain in 45 minutes. And I don't think any amount of dredging or whatever would solve that issue. Definitely a lot of rain causing a lot of problems, which Mayor Curry says he's looking into whether or not FEMA can actually come in and help pay for any damage that was possibly created by this flood yesterday. Meanwhile, he says now is the perfect time to remind everybody what we're always saying. Turn around. Don't drown. Do not drive in those floodwaters because we all saw those consequences playing out yesterday. Live in Vestavia Hills, Jamie Ostroff, CBS 42 News. Local coverage you can count on.